Captain. One turn for 800. Let's see if he gets a uh, cocoon going, like immediately like he did last time. The first time he actually got his javelin beetle out pretty quick. That gave me some trouble. I don't want to risk use, uh, losing you this early. Oh, uh, the loss, that's because I used a bunch of codes because this stream is just for fun. If I was playing for real, I probably wouldn't have used so many codes. But nothing was, like, overpowered or anything. You know, basically just low-level monsters and cards that I'd rather have instead of what I happen to get by chance. Actually, the reason this is labeled as Gillian's Angels is, uh, you see here. Right now I have all female monsters. Every monster in my deck is, uh, is female. Which I just did for fun as well. Okay. Okay, he's waiting for me to pass. Let's see what we have here. You don't use that, do you? No. Let's, uh, actually, let me put this here. Oh. Trap that, okay, it, trap card worked on the other trap card, I guess. And in addition to that, I did get a few good drops from the, the runs I've done so far. say it should still work. Still 2,000. Yep. You use that, but that's not gonna be enough. Let's do this, and there's no guarantee I won't go off on something else, so let's put you in defense mode. <clears throat> yep, there it is. There's Cocoon of Evolution. Maybe he'll be an idiot and override it again. Here we go. Okay. Now we got something. Though I'm wondering if I should save that for you. Oh, it's fine. I think this is more important.
That's okay. I got something else for you. There you go. chance it. What's the defense? Just barely. attack it now, but I don't know what that is. We've gotta be just about out of time by now. That cocoon's gonna evolve. Yeah, there it goes. Running out of places to go. What? What are you doing? You're attacking with it? Wow. Generally, that's not what you do with your Great Moth. See, it's only gonna lose 500. Um... I think I'm gonna lose you, actually. I could put that next to you and just hope that... Oh, she- oh, darn, she could have moved twice. I could have attacked directly. But then I'd still be in range of the Great Moth if I did that. Okay, I've got to have something more than 450. <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, man. I got three negate attacks.
That was not what that was for. Oh, maybe now I can. Uh... Is that... That was his block attack. with chain. I could cast you right next to him, though. But then I'd be kind of exposing myself. 2000 wouldn't quite do it. You could attack him directly. That's 2,000. But that block attack is there. I could also get the Maneater bug, but then I'm open. Okay, we gotta try it. Yep. I guess I miscounted. That was it. Okay, we won with uh, we won with perfectly ultimate great moth on the field. Pretty good. Okay, I want that infinite dismissal and that block attack. Shoot. Okay. Ah, too late. Well, man-eater bug, that's pretty good too. 